Hey everybody, it's Brandon again. I've gotten several questions on here as to whether or not WPS Office works on Chrome OS Flex. Now, I had never even heard of WPS Office, but um, I searched for it and we're going to try to install it and see if it works. Now, the first thing you need to know, this is not going to work until you enable the Linux development environment on your system. I have a whole video about that. And the long and short of it is you just go to settings and on the down here there'll be an advanced and developers and then here you'll be able to enable Linux. Now a lot of people have reported that this is not working for them on their Chrome OS Flex. It generally seems to be on older CPUs so that's something to keep in mind. You may not be able to do this but once you have the Linux environment loaded I just went to Google and I searched for WPS Office Linux and it brought me here. And on Chrome OS Flex, you're going to want to ins download the dev package. So we're doing that. We'll let that download. We'll close our browser here. And we'll wait in our downloads folder. Once you have um, Linux installed on this, you can download dev files and just double click on them to install them. But sometimes if you double click on one and it has a error just even loading the installer all you got to do is open your terminal first and i think that kind of starts up the linux subsystem i've noticed that on a few things so I'll minimize that our downloads nearly done i never test these things out before i do the video so if it fails i look like a fool in front of everybody Okay, you're downloaded. Let's double click on WPS Office and install. It says it's going. Installation in progress. We're at 0%. Who knows how long it'll take? This is a cheap Asus laptop I got on Amazon for, I think it was right around $200. It's called the Asus L210M. It has a Celeron processor, 4 gigs of RAM, super slow on Windows, but runs pretty good on Chrome OS Flex. And so if you got an old laptop, um, it's worth trying out Chrome OS Flex, I think, because it can really breathe new life into these these things. I also got this to install on a old 2011, I think, MacBook Air, which is pretty impressive because that thing was barely running with uh, Mac OS and it couldn't even get the latest Mac OS updates. So just PC or Mac, if you got an old laptop, it's not getting updates anymore. Slow, barely works. Look into Chrome OS Flex and check out my channel because I got a ton of videos trying different things on the system. And I'm trying to answer all the questions you guys have. Our installation was at 66% for a while. It's Jumped up to 88. I think we're getting somewhere. And once that installs, we're going to find it down at the launcher under Linux apps. 94% right now. That's because I'm at one minute. I guess we got one minute to go. Okay. If you see Office, an Office icon here, that's not the real Microsoft Office. It's like the web app, which is okay. Um, it's not the best. I don't, I haven't found using it to be very satisfying. But it's there if you want the Microsoft edition. However, what we're downloading here might be the way to go. <clears throat> waiting, waiting. Just so you know, another office alternative on these things is called LibreOffice. And I do have a bunch of new WPS icons in there. So it's obviously worked. Oh, it says installation complete. But anyway, if this doesn't work, LibreOffice is another option. You can check my other video for that. But let's uh, fire this up and see how it works. I guess this is their equivalent of Word. I got a license agreement. 
Yep, I read it. There's problems below detected. Some formula symbols might not be displayed due to missing fonts. Well, we can live with that, right? So this is WPS Office. Let's make a new document. Seems to work. Actually, as a system, this looks pretty nice. It looks better than LibreOffice, I'd say. It looks pretty similar to Microsoft Office. So that works. Let's see if we can save a file. Save. Saves in the Microsoft Office format. I'm pretty sure if you save anything under one of these Linux apps, it'll be in the Linux Files folder. Documents, there it is. There's my document. So that's good. Let's just try their spreadsheet app, if they have one. Yeah, WPS Spreadsheet. Same symbol font missing. I'm just going to say don't report again. Let's make a new document. Look at this. Well, this is a pretty nice little office suite. So for the several people who asked, I'd say yes. WPS Office works fine on Chrome OS Flex. Now you're seeing how to install it. Seen how to get it to work, so there it is. If you like this video, press the like button and subscribe and all that. And if there's anything else you want me to test out, just let me know. But uh, the bottom line here, I'd say WPS Office is a winner, and I might use it some more because it actually looks pretty nice. So there you go. Thanks for watching, and uh, you know, have a good day.